all you fans of GT Sport. Today I'm going to show you some really cool stuff on your SBG file compressing. I found a new free online compressor that works better than any of them that I've ever used and today I'm going to show you it and I'm going to show you how to use it. I think you guys will be using it a lot and I think you'll love it. The site's called Nano, and just unbelievable, drag and drop. You take your SVG file that you have of your decal you made, you just drag it right into here, and it takes it down real far. So... Let's, let's get us an SVG, or make us an SVG. Everybody loves Deadpool, so let's do a couple of them. So we'll do, save this image, and save this image. Let's see if they got a black one. Yeah, they do, right here. And we'll do this one. What's this one say? Yeah, this one's better. Okay, first thing we're going to do, I'm going to use Vector Magic. If you guys don't know what it is, I'll leave a link down below. It's one of the best programs out there to turn a PNG file or a photo into an SVG file. So you just drag that on top. Basic artwork high two color. Remove background. That's it. Pretty easy to use that too. Whoops, we didn't want it as an AI file. Delete. Save as SVG file. There it is. And when it comes out here, it's 20.5 which we know is too big you can only use 15 kilobytes and below so we know that's too big let's drag the next one on there background we might even keep that in there yeah I think we will alright so next done save SVG file that one <laughs> is small enough well we'll upload it anyway because I wanted to. And the last one. is SVG file that one is 29.2 so that one's bigger all right we'll get out of there 
get rid of that. Okay, I used to use an SVG compressor called SVG OMG. And it was working fine, but I had a lot of problems with it. I'll show you. So, the first problem I had with it is I don't even know all that stuff on the side was there. We're going to have to get rid of that. Was all the features down here. I don't know what any of this stuff means. So if I turn off something, it could be wrong. It could be right. I have no idea. But. It was simple enough to use if you didn't use any of that stuff, but it didn't always compress it because I didn't know the right stuff on there. So, to use it, you just hit the down arrow. Choose where you want your pile to go. And it brought it down to 16.1. Is this the white one? What was it originally? 29. So, that was the problem with that one. I don't know all those buttons over there and what they mean. And But with the Nano SVG compressor, you don't have to worry about it. They take care of all that stuff. All you have to do is drag and it compresses it. I'll show you. So, we'll take that same file that was 29 point something. And it compressed at 58.5%. When you get done with it, you just hit download. And it does the same thing. You choose where the file you want it to go. And you can title it. and save it so we would go back over here where it says Deadpool and the properties now see 12.1 kilobytes way better than the other one which was 16.1 which we know is too big of a file because you can only be 15 kilobytes so right there is four kilobytes saved and you don't have to go to all those buttons and switches and everything and you're like wow what does all this mean I don't understand I'm gonna show you another one we're gonna use this VG OMG we're going to drop it on there. We're going to hit the file compression. Okay. That one turned out 8.7. 8.17 kilobytes, which is small enough. But let's drop that one on there. download it and it took me down to 7.46 and it's a pretty big file when you open it up I mean that's huge
plus I've had problems with this one Where, wow, that didn't work at all. What the heck? See, that's another problem. Doesn't show up all the stuff because that's a dead pull on the side. There's a handle over here, and it's just not showing any of that. which kind of upsets me. It messes up. There's no one you can talk to about it. Half the time the server's down. When Nano, you just drop it on there, like I told you. It, saved, it tells you how much it saved, 51.2%. It's down to 9.99, which is way smaller than the other one that was 12. Plus, the whole picture is there. Didn't cut off anything. And if you ever have any problem with the nano server or it not converting at all, because I had a problem with that at Pros one time, down here in the corner it says chat with us and you can click on that and they'll help you with any problems that you have. They'll do a live chat or they'll go through email if you want to and they will fix the problem and they will get back to you right away because I've worked with them before. To me this is the best SVG file compressor that there is on the internet and it's free and they have live chat and they will help you with anything and they have other products you can check into some of them you have to pay for but they're really good but if you're looking for an SVG file compressor this is the best one out there I don't use nothing but this one now so in the comments down below guys let me know what you think about this thanks for watching our video and everybody have a great day.